Ever wondered how to avoid tourist traps in Amsterdam? It's a tale as old as time, tourists falling into the same old pitfalls. The allure of shiny souvenirs at sky-high prices, the charm of experiences that are anything but authentic, it's easy to fall prey to these snares but fear not, we're paving the path to a more authentic Amsterdam experience. Well, you're in luck. We're about to share some practical tips and tricks to help you dodge those tourist traps and discover Amsterdam's hidden gems. First and foremost, how do you identify a tourist trap? Well, there are a few telltale signs that should make your traveler's intuition tingle. One of the most obvious signs of a tourist trap is high prices. It's a universal truth that popular tourist spots often come with a hefty price tag. Whether it's an overpriced cup of coffee in a cafe with a picturesque view, or a simple souvenir that costs an arm and a leg, high prices are a clear indication that you've probably entered into a tourist trap. Another sign that you're in a tourist trap is crowded areas. Now, this may not always be the case as popular attractions naturally draw in large crowds. However, if you find yourself in a sea of people, all clamoring for the same experience or photo opportunity, it might be a hint that you're in a location that caters more towards mass tourism than genuine cultural exploration. Speaking of exploration, let's discuss souvenirs. Souvenirs are a wonderful way of taking a piece of your journey home with you. However, generic souvenirs are also a sign of a tourist trap. If you find a shop selling the same keychains, postcards, or t-shirts you've seen in every other shop, it's likely you've stumbled upon a tourist trap. And finally, the lack of local culture. Tourist traps often lack the authentic local vibe that makes a place truly special. If you're in a place where everything feels a bit too polished, a bit too perfect, and a bit too catered to tourists, you might be missing out on the authentic local experience. So, why should you avoid tourist traps? They often lack the authentic local culture and vibe that make a destination unique. They're designed to draw on tourists, often at the expense of showcasing the true heart and soul of the place. Now that you know how to spot a trap, let's discuss how to avoid them. Avoiding tourist traps is easier than you might think. In fact, sidestepping these common pitfalls can often lead to more memorable and authentic travel experiences. So, how can we do this effectively? Let's dive into some practical tips. First and foremost, do your homework. Research is your best friend when it comes to avoiding tourist traps. Look beyond the typical travel guides and explore blogs, social media, and local websites. These sources often have insider information that mainstream guides don't cover. They might lead you to hidden gems, less crowded but equally stunning sites, and offer tips on the best times to visit popular attractions. Secondly, dare to tread off the beaten path. While it's tempting to stick to well-known routes and attractions, venturing into lesser-known areas can be incredibly rewarding. You might discover a quaint cafe tucked away in a side street, a beautiful park untouched by the tourist masses, or a charming neighborhood that captures the true essence of the place. Next, be adventurous with food. Instead of dining at big-name restaurants that cater primarily to tourists, seek out smaller, local eateries. Try the local cuisine even if it sounds unfamiliar or daunting. Food is a significant part of culture, and trying local dishes can offer an authentic taste of your destination. And finally, don't be shy about interacting with locals. They are usually proud of their home and happy to share recommendations. Ask them about their favorite places to eat, the best spots to watch the sunset, or any upcoming local events. Remember, locals know their city better than any travel guide ever could. In conclusion, dodging tourist traps isn't about missing out on popular attractions, but about experiencing your destination in a more personal and authentic way. It's about stepping out of your comfort zone, trying new things, and truly immersing yourself in the local culture. Remember, the key is to venture off the beaten path and immerse yourself in the local culture. So, how do you find great places in Amsterdam, you might ask? Well, the answer lies in embracing the local way of life. One way to do this is by visiting local markets. They provide a great opportunity to mingle with the locals, discover unique products, and savor the flavors of Amsterdam. Try the Noordermarkt on a Saturday morning, where you can find everything from organic food to antique treasures. Another way to explore the city is by bike. 
Amsterdam is one of the most cycle-friendly cities in the world, and there's nothing quite like the feeling of freedom as you pedal along the city's charming streets and scenic canals. It's an experience that will bring you closer to the city's heart, away from the tourist crowds. And speaking of canals, taking a canal tour is a must, but instead of the larger, more touristy boats, opt for a smaller, more intimate tour. They can take you to parts of the city that the larger boats can't reach. Now let's talk about some lesser known yet fantastic spots. The Jordan neighborhood with its narrow streets and quaint houses is a charm. The nine streets offer an array of unique shops and cafes. And the Eastern Docklands, with its modern architecture and vibrant cultural scene, is a testament to Amsterdam's ability to blend the old with the new. Amsterdam is full of hidden gems waiting to be discovered. You just need to know where to look. In conclusion, Avoiding tourist traps in Amsterdam isn't as daunting as it may seem. We've journeyed through the process of spotting these tourist traps, the telltale signs of overpriced souvenirs, crowded attractions, and generic experiences that don't quite capture the essence of this vibrant city. We've also shared practical tips on how to steer clear of these traps. Remember to do your own research, look out for local recommendations, and don't be afraid to venture off the beaten path. Our discussion also highlighted some of the great places to visit in Amsterdam, from the charming Jordan district to the bustling Albert Kuip market. These are the places where the locals hang out, where the culture thrives, and where you can truly experience the heart of Amsterdam. Embrace the local culture, dive into the rich history, and savor the unique experiences Amsterdam has to offer. You're now equipped with the knowledge to dodge those tourist traps and experience the real Amsterdam. Safe travels!